Hey guys, welcome back. Unlucky and the channel's game on. We're just keep on gaming on. We got more Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. <clears throat> Preparing ourselves for Dragon Dogma 2 that comes out here at the end of March. We're so excited for that. So, I think we've done all the worm requests. I think we're about to get up in this castle. We can rest till day or night. Well, you're not Maximilian. Why am I talking to you? It will be my honor to show the choice is yours. Yeah, so let's hear the distraction. See, you do not take it lightly. Here are the details. What are Wondrous the details? tidings are risen. The Duke is to grant you an audience. Yeah, well, damn right. His Grace wishes to commend you for your valor and your service Bingo. to the land. Uh huh. Know, however, that any you will oh. also be asked to return your writ of permission to join the hunt. So at this point. If you haven't completed any of the quests, you'll be locked out of them if you give back the writ. Also, some of the side quests that haven't been completed, some of the escort missions, you're going to be locked out of. So this is a good point. If you've got any stuff to take care of before we move on to really the next stage in the game, which is the second third of the game, you should take care of them now. Anything Casardus, anything back behind you. There's nothing I can think of off the top of my head for me, myself, besides getting back from Bitter Black Isle and get some stuff out of that. So let's continue. If you have aught left undone, pray tend to it afore you come to see the Duke, sir. I must be clear, your audience with His Grace will put an end to any current tasks, and you will be asked to return your license to the Worm Hunt. Knowing that, are you prepared to see His Grace now? We are. <clears throat> you are quite certain. No tasks left incomplete? No need for the license to the hunt? Understood. Then pray, enter the castle, sir. A guide awaits within to see you to his grace. Sounds so ominous. Where are you running? Duke Edmund is a famed hero who drove away a dragon of his own. This audience is proof of his cooperation. Duke Edmund is a famed hero who drove away a dragon of his own. Uh -huh. This audience is proof of his cooperation. Now, this is our first chance to get inside the actual castle gates here. Duke Edmund defeated a dragon once too. Regulations forbid pawns from entering the Duke's castle. When you visit the castle, your pawn will wait outside and rejoin you when you leave. And there's a reason for that. We'll find out later what it is. Let's see what's over here in the gardens. There's a few treasure chests around. I don't want the bucket, I want the chest. Conqueror's Parapet. I never use any of those. I can just double jump all over the place in this game. It's so fun. That is also one of my favorite abilities that I've found. Observation room. Let's go observe. Ooh, I like the high chant can and music. Throw drops. I'll probably die if I fall off of that, right? At least these daggers are strong enough to just one-shot crates, right? <clears throat> huh. If we go the other way. It's a little bit twitchy. Large coin pouch, baby. Small coin pouch, uh huh. Oh yeah, awesome. We like coin pouches, huh? Don't we? You're definitely gonna die if we fall off of here, right? Actually, I don't think so. It'll be okay. Cause we're gonna hit that, and then we're gonna hit this. Yeah, that was okay. What's this? <gasps> Look at all these. Holy cow! Uh, it's all just gonna be potions. It's not gonna be anything really. Crazy. Trusty sword? No way. Is a trusty sword just sitting over here? Or whatever, royal banner, who cares? But what's the trusty sword? A sword forged from light yet durable material, built for agile fighters who would stay nimble in battle. The assassin, the mystic knight, and the fighter. Decent, not great. Nothing special to it. Not for our class, anyways. 
Hey, look, seagulls. Yeah. Some green warsh. We always want our green warsh. <clears throat> Did I just see something right there? Potent green warsh. Harp's mad. Man, these chests are all over the place here. Along with some potent green wash. Okay, we'll take the cloud wine. Potent green wash. No need to buy anything. We can just run around this place and stock up on everything. Let's check the other side, and then we'll go inside and meet Duke Edmund. Hopefully it's not upset. Wait, Nosh. I want to find the Hydra, too. I've never found the Hydra in this game. If anybody knows where the Hydra is, tell me down in the comments so I can go fight him. If not, I'll ask that. <clears throat> if not, I'll ask any of my friends and see if any of them know. The Angels Parapet. So we got the Conquerors and then the Angels. It's an observation room this way. Definitely die if you fall off of this. Oh, and there's a chest up here. What's this? Well, we don't care about the rock. World banner. There we go. fall. Ooh, that was risky business right there. I'm not really into parkour in real life, to be honest. <clears throat> I think that shit's kind of crazy. Like, some of the stuff those guys do where they jump from building to building, I'm just like, you are out of your mind. Couldn't even get me to the edge without wanting to have a heart attack. What's in here? Throw blast. Tis shut tight. Okay, screw you. Okay, so that's pretty much everything outside of this immediate spot. <clears throat> Let's go in here and see what Edmund's up to. Ed Money! Oh, wait, we got this little joker. Oh, gosh. No, no, shoot. The humble shards of home for the heavy depths of cart. Pray, let this token from humble Festy garner favor with the leviathans within. <laughs> oh, tut tut, no time for thanks, Frank. The Duke awaits. Sail on, dear knight. Sail on. <laughs> Man, I just dropped all those mangoes on the ground. <laughs> Gotta save some of them. This guy's gonna get a beating for that. We're gonna put up with that. Longevity can seem a curse when it means living to see such time. I'll grant such gaiety may unite the men and stoke them to greater valor. But do we truly have the time to lend such pursuits with a dragon upon us? True. Word of your feats has reached us here, sir. You've the worm's own strength to clip the Hydra's pate. No doubt you'll prove more than equal to the dragon. I hope so. I cannot fathom his grace's waste of coin on such festivity. Same, I'll not refuse his wine. Oh, yeah. 
Nor will I. The Duke. I fear your crown outshines my own. <laughs> I'm insulted. Command, every road in Francis shall be open to you henceforth as a member of the world. Out. All right. May your efforts help deliver us from the shadow of the dragon. As long as that damnable beast draws breath, I'll fail except any of them. <laughs> Didn't seem like he believed in us that much. So, now all those places that were closed off behind the shadow fort, other spots are open. Let's see what our orders are. I've heard talk. You're the Arisen, eh? It's quite an honor to be employed by the Duke himself. I feel like it. Let us speak another time, sir. Danger stalks the capital even now. Are the rest of you truly blind to that simple truth? I know not, sir. The sovereign of this land ill comprehends the urgency of the danger it faces. This eve's empty pomp is ample proof. All gaiety without a hint of real concern. I'll allow. Tis well understandable. A people numbed by two generations of peace cannot be expected to know true resolve. He's got a lesson opinion. taught by fire and sacrifice. Pray let his grace learn before the fire takes all. But I ought not speak in such <laughs> bold terms before his grace. Before his grace? Don't like his accent. All through my reign, I foresaw the coming of this danger. And so I gathered men into armies, stones into strongholds. I readied for war, and then you were risen. You came to us, and the dragon with you. Pray, think on the meaning of that, and of your duty. A little bit of a misspeak right there. <laughs> you, what are you up to? Arisen, I would speak with you. This is not the place. It is a conversation best had after dark. Huh. Meet me in the courtyard by me. Interesting, okay. Little side quest there. Where do I get my main missions now? Your feats in the worm hunt have earned you an audience with Duke Edmund himself. Perhaps he will offer missions of great merit. Your audience with the Duke was oddly solemn. Speak to his age, to his grace's agent, to, to learn of the royal orders you may now undertake. Okay. <coughs> Even as his. Oh, this little jester. Is that who it is? Nope. Somebody else out here. I guess we're supposed to go talk to her. Apologies, dear warrior, but to see a face austere as the castle walls adorned with this <laughs> still <laughs> is more agreeable than the endlessly dour air of most of my husband's song swords. Valor dwells in the heart, after all. The brave ought not need their raiment to speak for their metal, no? Oh no. Uh oh. Hey, 
Hail, dear warrior of the lovely helm. Ah. I fear I am remiss in asking your names. Arisen? You must forgive me. I fear I am grossly ignorant in matters of war. I had thought all who fought shared the title warrior. But again, you must excuse me. I am Eleanor, come just a few days past as a bride to the Duke. I pray you will serve my lord husband faithfully, Sir Warrior. Hmm. No, we well. I presume the crown you bear is a mark of your station as the Arisen. I must apologize for my laughter, good sir. I assure you I meant no... She's got a lot to say. You would gift me your crown, dear warrior? You are far too... I shall cherish it. <laughs> really? Did I? I shall pray for your safe travels, sir. Huh. And then there's a weird... Until we meet again. That's weird. I shall pray for your safe travels, sir. So she had all that side talk. We gave her that jester crown, and now it's making a weird sound, guys, every time I talk to her. I don't know what the hell that's about. Continue munching mangoes and moving on. Look at you guys. By decree of the Duke, you were to be allowed free passage into the castle. This right extends only to your person, and you are advised to comport yourself fittingly. A grievous breach in conduct will see you removed from the castle, or worse. You will take your orders from the Duke's Chamberlain, Aldous. Speak to him for further instruction. May the Maker see you on to further glory, sir. How fared your audience with His Grace, Arisen? Aldous Ludric Sorn at your service, sir. I serve as a Chamberlain in the Duke's court. As you may have seen for yourself, it seems His Grace is... Unwell. In truth, there is worry enough to make any man's head ache, but I fear he ails of worse than worry. Perhaps I ought not speak further on the matter, for my own well-being. I am charged with assigning royal orders, tasks of great import issued by the Duke himself. Pray forgive the bother, but I ask that you come to see me here in the castle whenever circumstances allow you to take on assignment. The future of this war is murky, sir. May your efforts help to bring its end into sight. Yeah, well, that's what we do. 10,000. <clears> Having met with the Duke, you may now take on royal orders. Seek out Chamberlain Aldous within the palace. All right. Who are you? We shall do as His Grace commands. Well, um... Was well, he in the palace or is he over here? Sure looks like he's over here. Tis a mercy there's work to Huh. Oh. So that's for the uh, nighttime mission, the conspirators. We're not going to do that. We're going to go and see the Duke and get a Duke mission. We're going to go see Aldous and get one of the Duke's missions. Where the hell is Aldous? He'll go no further. Oh, I won't, eh? What if I jump in there? Nope. He'll go no further. All right, you caught me twice. Screw it. There he is. You are to see me for your assignments and no one else. I speak for his grace on such matters. My word is his. As such, any task deserves your full and immediate attention. Hmm. No reason. Pray, make your choice, sir. 
Say the corpse no, no, on her. You're aware the roads are ever more overrun with beasts of every stripe. Yep. I think we actually have to do both these quests. The I don't think it matters which one you do first. Since the dragon's coming, trade has suffered. Citizens, a company of them. It is no perfect solution, but it is a start. I would ask you. There's been no end of reports of caravans bearing tribute bound for Grand Soren being waylaid by monsters. Among them, the direst threat is posed by the griffin. It is not a creature easily quelled, but we can ignore it no longer. Hence the company of elites. And now it seems they are prepared to face the beast. Did we get one already? They stand in wait outside the castle gate. Go and speak with them for further detail. Chris Warmy did that. I fear this may be a long battle, sir. May the maker be your shield. Well, I'll be my own shield, and I'll be yours too. We shall shield the realm. How's our supplies looking? Plenty of green wash. And 40 mushrooms. Okay, we'll see how far 40 mushrooms gets us. Oh, we used 60 on the last adventure because I bought 100. Never know what you might find on the city streets. Keep your eyes with the men of the core have planned. It pains me to burden you, busy as you are with the royal orders, but there is aught I would speak of with you. It is oh. a cause of worry, though I speak only for myself and not as Chamberlain. Might I beg a moment? Of course, Maximilian. Skeletons have been sighted <clears throat> near the capital these past few days. Elsewhere, I've had no end of reports of secret meetings among the zealots of salvation. I cannot help but see the two as intertwined, though I have no evidence to prove it. Still, I'll be damned if I allow their kind to go corrupting the minds of good people for want of evidence. Arisen, I ask this as a favor. Will you look into these events and hunt out any thread that connects them? I believe I've learned where the cult meets. I've made note of it on your map. I ask you begin your search there. Go and learn what you can. Okay. Got to investigate more secret meetings between Salvation. The necromancers. But meetings take place within the capital. I hear your words. I ill like this place arisen. I ill like this place arisen. All right, whatever. You can't talk to us doing her healing thing, but thank you. Good morning. Okay. I would think the bow best suited to hunting griffins. There's a fight against four with spells and arrows. Well, I've got a bow and a bunch of spells. Someone in the castle Excuse me. Be the I'm actually a badass. <laughs> Mystic Archer, or Magic Archer, excuse me. Mystic Knight, Magic Archer. <clears throat> now, like I said before, I did play as a Mystic Knight the first time through. I was a fighter and then I changed vocation to Mystic Knight. It was pretty cool. Who among us? I hear no end of an audience with a Duke now. You've become quite the lordling. Impressive, really. Have your pick, any you like. What will it be today? Well, we already have spent all our points there. Have your pick, come again. Okay, we're just gonna go out. Well, let's see about the quest here. Flames will be a great asset. Yeah, we're not doing any of those. We don't do escort quests. Unless forced to, which we have been. Oh, hey, what's up? Here now. A warrior such as yourself seeks always finer weapons, yeah? Oh, you yeah. Me in a <clears throat> so you shall have access to weapons both fearsome and powerful. Yeah. Excellent. So, have you heard tell of the master weaponsmith in these parts? Uh -uh. His talent is without measure, but he's stubborn as a plow beast and sells only to a chosen circle of clients. To such patrons, he gifts an idol to make his favor known. I must gain such an icon and access to his wares no matter what the cost. It's often been said you possess a talent for discovery. Secure me a figurine, and I shall provide weapons the likes of which you have never dreamed. What say you? Will you help? The master works all, you can't go. <clears throat> well, he's got new weapons. Anything for us? Snag daggers. Wow. <clears throat> Not near as good.
I know that stuff's really that good. Yeah, no way. We're good. Master works all you can't. Okay, Master work go. come again. We'll need to break I think it's a bronze idol. That's what it is. I can't remember where I got it before. A place one can live without fear of monsters. The Duke's men are assembled. Let's hurry to join them. Oh, hey, here we go. Beg pardon, Arisen. I'm sure this is a small matter, but I would yet have you hear it. Look at all these quests we've got I was got at now. my post before the castle not long ago when a strange man came round asking after your whereabouts. Even more curious. But when I told him I knew not, he swore me, tell no one of our encounter. Have you some enemy arisen? Is I? I beg you. I don't know, man. We've got a lot of enemies right now, I bet. Oh, look at these guys. They look special. Beware of ambush, nameless terror. Man, that music is so ominous. <laughs> Were they gonna attack or what? Last time I never ran into them. That was all they ran. You might be our escort. Aye, we are the company of elites you're to march with. A poor jest, I know. We'll circle the capital, striking the griffin as we come upon it along the way. We attack when it sets down. It is nothing so clever as to be called a stratagem, but it will work. If you still care to join us after hearing all that, let's be off. I've gained quest. <coughs> We're to lure the griffin aground, then strike. Let's follow Sir Gale. Yeah, well, we've already beat this griffin once, but let's get him again. I'd feel better at ease with a few more Focus. Men. The hunt is afoot. He's a sovereign in the world. The hunt is afoot. So, we're going to stop the game here, guys, just in case we're under the griffin. We're going to start the next episode. We'll continue hunting for the griffin here on Game On. Unlucky. It's so Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. <clears throat> Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.